With more than two years to go, St. Vincent and the Grenadines are said to have achieved all eight Millennium Development Goals before the set 2015 deadline. Delivering a lecture at the French's house last evening to mark the 102nd anniversary of the St. Vincent Girls High School, former GHS student and Chief of Staff at the Caribbean Medical Imaging Center, Dr. Roslyn Ambrose, while speaking on the topic, the Millennium Development Goals, the SVG Barometer, presented data which shows that St. Vincent and the Grenadines on the national level has already accomplished 100% of the expectations set out by the United Nations, while collectively only 25% has been achieved thus far on an international level. One. Globally, they say yes, they could achieve goal number one, um, but only between 47 and 27 percent. For St. Vincent and Grenadines, we've done that. We do not have this problem of hunger and poverty as reflected by the rest of the world. For goal number two, they've admitted it's unfulfilled. They will not achieve the universal secondary education globally, primary education globally, but we've done that in St. Vincent. To promote gender equality, we've done that. And they've admitted that particularly when it comes to this empowering women, they will not make that goal. But we've done that. When it comes to reducing child mortality, we have done that. Even though globally they say they can only get to between from 12 to 7.7 .7 million um, in terms of saving child mortality, and we've done that. Our statistic is below the global and the regional margin. Improving maternal health, we've done that. They're still working on it, and they say it's going to be unfulfilled. Assessing SVG's progress thus far in relation to the MG MDG goal number six, which deals with combating HIV and AIDS, Dr. Amber Rossell's SVG has a good margin of detection and cure rate for HIV and AIDS. Now, how about goal number seven? Uh, globally, they say that for them, it's going to be unfulfilled. We say, yes, we can do it because we have the problem with the sanitation. We've conquered that. We need to slow down the landfill thing. And if you notice that the private sector has got into recycle your bottles and so on. So we need to pay more attention to that initiative and work with it and make it more real. And uh, in terms of the global partnership for development, um, it's okay. It's okay. We've uh, already conquered, we've introduced that we collaborate with regional, international, and local partners to work on our global partnership for development. So I figure really, we've done them all. 100% before the year 2015, while they've only accomplished 25% of it. Meanwhile, Dr. Ambrose says there are many indicators which show that a number of the reporting sources on SVG in, in relation to the MDGs were flawed and biased in many ways. So really, you know, you have to say of the eight Millennium Development Goals, the reporting sources, I gave them three skunks because 40% of the time their reporting was unreliable, unrebiased, or totally incorrect. And folks, I am sure that my hypothesis of this is absolutely correct. And so I rest my case.